Hello Federal viewers, I am in Coimbatore. I am going to talk to an important candidate from the DMK, Mr. Ganapati Rajkumar. He is contesting from the very prestigious constituency in Coimbatore. The results of Coimbatore constituency is awaited, not just only in Tamil Nadu, it's most watched across India. Hello sir. Hello. Sir, you have mentioned in many of your campaigns that there is a there are two phases of Coimbatore. One is pre-GST and post-GST. What is it and uh, what are the developments you want to look at? Actually, I am talking about post-GST. Post-GST has, uh, what to say, uh, is making Coimbatore to cripple. It has come down. Once it is supposed to be the Manchester of uh, South India is losing its charm and glory. Its industrial phase is being slowly wiped away from Coimbatore because of GST. Okay, but uh, now this city is no more just a grinder production hub. It wants to grow, it needs to grow. What are your plans? What is in your wish list? We want to take this issue in the parliament. We will win. We are very confident. In this election, the, uh, pro, this thing, the schemes of the chief minister has reached the grassroots level. So we get a very good reception, especially from the women folk. So we are confident that we will win. So we are going to raise the issue in the parliament regarding GST, excesses of GST. Sometimes we ask, we have uh, requesting to abolish GST. Okay, okay. Sir, actually cutting across party lines, I just want uh, to uh, you know, know your view about the campaign still being followed by your rivals, Anna Malai and Singhai Ramachandran. They dance, they sing and they do all kinds of dramas. How, how, how do you look at this? Just cutting across party lines. I want to... They live in social media, they go social media, not in reality. But we go to the field, we meet the people, we explain what the chief minister has done and the people reciprocate and they say they have, uh, uh, they have uh, received it. So that is our uh, positivity. Instead of wasting our time elsewhere, we are going and meeting the people throughout the constituency. So that's what we score here. Okay, okay. So drug abuse seems to be a very sensitive issue across the western belt of Tamil Nadu and both BJP and the ADMK many times they criticize there are some links of DMK with the drug mafia. How do you counter this? I don't think there is a link between the drug, drug mafias and DMK. It is uh, what to say, it is a tailor-made uh, issue. Actually, drugs are controlled by the central government of India. You don't uh, uh, have second doubt about it. So it is the problem with this, uh, this thing. Uh, central government to, what to say, to reduce the problem. Okay. So uh, what are your uh, promises for your uh, voters this time? Yeah, we have some promises for the people regarding the parliamentary election. That is, we want the expansion of the Coimbatore airport. It is long awaiting. It has been waiting for 10 years. Low, that is lying low for 10 years. Again, we want the speedy implementation of the metro train uh, program and also the railway station, it is being neglected. For the, It is also for the past 10 years, it is, it is being neglected. We want many more trains from Coimbatore. We want shuttles to connect Coimbatore and nearby cities. So that is the first three points. We are going to take it up after we win the election. Subscribe to the Federal's YouTube page for more news and updates.